Sculpting is what one calls the kind of art that involves shaping clay, chipping away at marble or any other material. But not all sculptures convey feelings nor seek to contribute something to society. That, however, is Donnie McManus's goal. While creating shapes and figures, he also wants to remind society of the importance of each person and the importance of human dignity. Essentially is to communicate uh, the, the deepest aspects of the human condition through the human body because the human body is the perfect vehicle for communicating the human condition and uh, if, there, if people don't understand the vocabulary of the human body, anatomy, colour, texture, tone, if they don't understand these things, if they don't understand the basic vocabulary of the human body, they will never be able to communicate the fullness of the human condition. But most importantly for an artist is their inspiration and in Donnie McManus' case he has no doubts. The main inspiration for my work is my faith. Uh, a lot of the works I've done are of, of sacred themes and in particular uh, the figure of Saint Joseph is a reoccurring theme in my work um, and I like uh, basically it's mo mostly inspired by the writings of Saint Josemaria Escrivá, founder of Opus Dei, uh, because he talks about Saint Joseph as a young virile man uh, but also compassionate and loving and that's that's something I wanted to capture in my work. Donnie McManus wants to convey a very specific message to society. He wants to present the importance of parenting in today's world. This image of Saint Joseph as, uh, as strong and compassionate and loving and intimate and uh, this is also a way of uh, encouraging the vocation of, of fatherhood because it's something I noticed I noticed a lot in my work I, I do quite a bit of social work in Dublin and in New York in, in New York in the, in the Bronx and so on where you notice that there's a real crisis in some areas of fatherhood. An artist who out of every masterpiece shares a gift with society a sculptor who makes his work a daily encounter with humanity.